Hello, 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 mine fans. Here we are back in noonday again at the top of this wonderful decline down to the lower levels and uh, War Eagle below. And um, what we're going to do here is you can see the ladder here, which is a very good ladder. It was probably an excellent ladder 100 years ago. But right now I can use some TLC. So me and Jason, that's him right there. Um, we are going to be going down this ladder for a bit and replacing some of the bad steps there on a uh, case by case. Anything that's cracked or really worn through, we're going to start prying the old ones out and putting some new ones in. It's definitely not going to be something we're going to get done today, uh, but we're going to get a good start on it. We got uh, 30, 40 steps here in the wheelbarrow, some decent power tools, a couple of pry tools. So we're going to be prying. The old steps off, hopefully getting the nails out without too much trouble, and then using those nice Ryobi tools, including that wonderful impact driver, to put the new ones in place. So that's today's agenda, making this place safer and easier to explore and get through. And um, we are on it. Let's take a little look around this beautiful underground hoist house here. Or here there was used to be a hoist in here that came down from the other side and ran all the way down here and that's about 500 feet all the way to the bottom it's got a decent angle and probably some of the best ladder in the complex except for the fact that again some of the steps have been broken off over the years by excessive wear and people stepping on them boredly but we're going to fix that and well i could talk or you can watch us do it so let's get to it okay here's a step that needs to go again nice old wood but been stomped on in the middle so much and starting to crack a bit in the side, so attack that crack. Work the nail with the, the nail puller outer. And now I just got two more nails on each side to go, but I got to start here. So yeah. that's the kind of what we really don't want to keep in place here. Yeah, one missed step on a step like this is a long way to the bottom. So, there we go. That's two. I'm trying to be easy on this because I don't want to damage the vertical board. This one, that one's out. All right. Yeah, there's, no, there's another one out. One step out. Already for a replacement. When Jace works his way down here with the power tools, I'm going to go down and find another one that needs to be replaced. It's a long way to the bottom if you want to rock and roll. It's a long way to the bottom if you want to rock and roll. Hey, hey. Ah, I'm down here on level now, which I think is probably about 200 feet down or so. See Jace coming out of yet more boards a couple steps we've already got out of here some are pretty good some were obviously replacements at some time it's not the first time this ladder has been rebuilt others really need uh, some work and some tlc we'll get as many as we can and i'll come back and and get more i'll tell you prying these things out of here ain't no joke that wood's solid the nails are still strong and even though the steps themselves may be pretty bad in the middle, they're anchored pretty good, most of them. So, definitely uh, burning the calories down here and getting the work done and getting down a nice little level over here. Kind of cool. And swinging around through the works over here. Got another level behind me I can't really get to without putting myself in a precarious spot, but. 
pretty happy with the work that's getting done. Putting ladder patches in here, joining two ends together that weren't attached before. We have two by fours and three screws and the impact driver. And this sucker's gonna be solid. Oh yeah, gotta get that. Yeah, there you go. Okay, hit that one a couple more. Wipe that sweat off that board before you rot my board, sir. <laughs> and I'll put a step across there and we'll uh, anchor into both the, uh, the old upright and the new step, or the new uh, patch. This is how you do it, folks. It may be getting a little overdone in spots, but ladder's only as strong as its weakest link. And my weak link ain't gonna be here. So, drilling pilot holes now. And then putting the screws in place. Long way up there. We all the way down on a level here. So while he's doing that, I'll show you the level again. Mm -hmm. Our ladder gets a little steeper down there. We start getting some of that square set. I say the ladder gets a bit steeper when we start getting to the square set. You'd be tooling over my, my narration here. But a lot of wood back down in here. It's a beautiful area. A lot of mineral on the wall, too. I'll put our step across. Yeah, give it a bit of love into the uh, patch, too. Okay. Let me put one of these in. Right in the middle of here. Oh, a little more over here. There you go. They just sink in tight with an impact wrench, gets a piece. All of you who recommended the impact driver, thank you. This is like the coolest thing ever. Never had it before, but I love this sucker. Awesome. <laughs> All right. This is how you do it. Uh, looking down, down, down again. Okay, after you know, a few hours and a little exploration and a lot of rung replacing and ladder bracing here, like a little patch job over there, and this new little side step down under here. Rock solid. New steps going up the ladder where, as they were needed. Didn't get them all, but <clears throat> we got the worst ones. Made this, uh, this section of the ladder at least a lot safer, so... Just take a little climb up and see what we got, shall we? See if I can do this without dropping my phone. <laughs> Don't drop the phone. Don't drop the phone. Don't fall down the shaft and don't drop the phone. Yeah, some of these could definitely use a little more work, but we just got the worst of the worst on this trip. Here's one of our replacements. That's pretty. Couple more replacements here. Got a few missing. A few missing? Yeah. I thought we was replacing them on the way up. I don't know what... Missed a couple. All right, well, it is what it is. We'll get them on the next one. You still got one in your bag, right? Uh, no, my bag's clear, I think. What do you do with that one you had? I think you got it down there, yeah? No. Yeah, maybe I did put it in here. Good help is so hard to find.
a lot of mineral on the wall here. It's only a couple feet thick and it goes into that big stoped area, which judging by our explorer on there, that was all square set at one time. And that square set was probably would have been one of the best square sets in the mine, but square set always works great until it doesn't. And that one gave up one day. And Let's go up and watch Jason do this cool stuff, shall we? <laughs> Why don't we replace that one you're standing on? That would have been a good one to replace. Oh well. Next time. This is what it takes to fix mines, people. Oh, look at all those old steps. That's old scrap wood. Okay. One screw short. <laughs> Listen. We can hit that later. All right. At least, at least it's there. All right. And they're all good to the top. And there's the, the frame up there. So shoot, we should have counted from the bottom where we stopped. Next time we'll do that. Going up. Do, 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 do. All right, enough of this.